welcome back to code tonight in today's video we will see how we can encrypt and decrypt password in asp.net so uh, there are some times we require to uh, secure our passwords while saving in the database so uh, we will see how we can uh, create a secure passwords and how we can decrypt those so uh, here we have a asp.net project and uh, uh, here what I have done is I have created two ways for encrypting the password. So the first way is a uh, base64 conversion. So in this method uh, we just convert the uh, password to a base64 format and then we will just save that and in the second way of encryption we have used a more secure way of uh, encrypting password and that is by using the RFC algorithm okay so we will provide you the code but uh, first we will just see how it works uh, so base 64 string is basically a uh, conversion where a normal password will be converted to a string which will be readable but no one can actually understand the uh, exact password from that so for example we are entering here pass new which will be our password and we will see how it will encrypt so we can click on encrypt and here you will see that the first method of encryption visits which is base64 method uh, it has converted the password to this format and it is user readable but uh, they cannot understand what it is written okay and the second method is converting the uh, string to a more complex uh, uh, string which is uh, um, tough for actual tough for readers to understand what is the real password so uh, there, is, there are two methods for encryption and we also have two methods for decryption of the encrypted strings so uh, for decrypting the base64 we have this method available so we are passing the encrypted password here and you will see that on, decry on decryption it will provide us the uh, real password and same with the uh, RFC encryption we are passing the string here and we are uh, decrypting the password over here to a original password so uh, you can see that this is the uh, original password and this is the base 64 conversion and this is a more complex conversion which is a rfc algorithm okay so uh, in rfc algorithm uh, i will just show you so in this algorithm we actually uh, use a key over here to encrypt the uh, passwords and you can modify the key but uh, you have to remember that you have to keep the uh, same key in the decrypt password also only then it will be able to encrypt uh, successfully and decrypt successfully so uh, this is how you can encrypt and decrypt the passwords and uh, if you want to get the code then you can just uh, go to our official website cotonet.com i will also provide you the and direct link for the code so uh, on this website you can search encrypt and there you will find a blog of how to encrypt and decrypt password in asp.net and so uh, here you can find all the methods that I just showed you by using and you can see the encrypt methods here and also the decrypt method here so you can use those and you can also download the attachment from here so um, this is how you can encrypt and decrypt password in asp.net so thanks for watching guys and if you face any kind of issue then you can comment on the video so thanks for watching